So first I thought this trailer would be actually coming out next week. I, that's what I thought from Ben Watt, but no, nope, it comes out today. But yeah, again, there are other things that I can target Ben Watt from doing that have pissed me off in the past. Well, we're not talking about that today. Today, we are going to be talking about Battlefront 2 to the Battle Geonosis, to some other things about Battlefront 2, and a bit of a solution to the officer and the assault of it. Here's the intro. So before we actually begin, I'm going to show you the Battle Genosis trailer, and if you want to watch it again, link down below. The balance of the Force has been shaken. The Clone Wars have begun. Target that speeder! Your move. So now let's talk about it. So, first thing, Geonosis. We see Geonosis as the Galactic Assault map as of at this time. It's not set to come to ev any other mode. But, in this Genosis um, thing, we see a lot of stuff going on around it. We see that it's one of the biggest maps. Some of the vehicles that we see from the other Galactic Assault maps are also in this one. We also see the new vehicles we do, and um, we also see nothing of Wookiee, so I guess, well, congratulations to you guys. We also see Obi-Wan Kenobi, we do, and of two of his skins, his default skin and the Wobe skin also. Um, we also hear the voice actor James Arnold Taylor, who is doing this, and also some of his abilities. Obi-Wan looks amazing, he does, and I'm more hyped than ever. We also, as I've just said, we see old and new vehicles in this. We also see some clone skins, apparently some of them have also been fixed for the November update. And then also the ending of this shows of the new Grievous skin for this month. And this is basically if Grievous lived after he was shot in the heart by Kenobi in episode 3. And that's the Battle Genosis trailer. So some other things. So the transmission video for um, the Obi-Wan Kenobi update will be coming as usual next week. I'm looking around that I think it will definitely come on the day that the update comes like it did before. And then also um, some good news for you that as a true, and now I haven't heard this from anyone else so you may want to deconfirm it if I'm wrong in the comments. As a true has reportedly said that the Obi Wan Kenobi skin, now supposed to be coming in January, has been moved over for December now, including a bunch of other bug fixes for December. So it's looked like you're going to get some stuff, but it doesn't look like to be much. And then also, um, finally, just a bit of a recap for basically next week. We've got the Battle G Genosis trailer, um, sorry, Battle Genosis update, and including the community update video, and then question mark on the roadmap. So I don't want to talk too much about this, I usually read the transmission, but I just want to talk about it a little. The overall community transmission came out a couple of hours before the trailer came out. This, tr this transmission revealed what Obi-Wan Kenobi would look like in his full form. 
we know what he looks like for instance in the last community update to some of the photos but this one gave us the robe appearance and the default appearance and basically say in one of the descriptions being that he his fighting style will be different but also um, unique considering about what type of Jedi he is so it looks like to be that and I cannot wait to play him. So by now you may have heard about the officer of how the community want the battle point system to be um, for some of the points to be reduced now of course this will happen but I will say this if it does happen I don't think the solution will be removing it before if it does happen look I was in an area in one galactic assault map where I was around a lot of people at the very start, start, start. And the thing about getting a thousand points could be something, but I only got up to 374. So even if you reduced it down to five, I bet you'll still be able to get up to the hundred areas of it. And the only way to stop people from getting to one of 1,000 credits at the start of the match is you do something more than that. Removing won't solve it. Removing basically means that the officer will get less used after it's been wagged up. So, yeah. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Um, cannot wait for the content for Battlefront 2. Anyway, peace guys. See ya. And may the force be with you.